Every line item in Xactimate's price list are made up of at least two parts, its category code and its selector code. I'm going to tell you a little about these codes to help you learn how to estimate a little faster. The category code comes first and is always three letters. This code tells you what construction trade or phase the item belongs to and is usually something that you'll recognize. FCC for floor covering carpet, FCW for floor covering wood, PNT for paint, CLN for clean, etc. If you don't have any filters set for your estimate, you can see a complete list of category codes by clicking the CAT Smart List button under Quick Entry and Estimate Items. The selector code comes next, and it identifies a particular item within that category or trade. It can be as short as one character or as long as seven characters or more. You can see a complete list of selector codes for each category by clicking the Select Smart List button under Quick Entry and Estimate Items after having already selected your category. Many of these codes have a logic behind their naming, making it likely that you'll begin remembering the codes even without actively trying to remember them. For example, if you are entering framing wood, your category code is FRM, and your selector code might be 1X8 or 2X12, indicating the size of the board. Many categories have an AV selector code indicating that this is considered the most common line item in this category of average size and quality. You can adjust the quality of some line items by adding a minus to indicate standard grade, or a plus to indicate high grade, or even a double plus to indicate premium grade. In addition, some items use the greater than or less than symbols to indicate size. So for example, a small aluminum slider window of premium grade would be WDA AV less than plus plus. Once you start making note of your category and selector codes, you can start entering your most commonly used and remembered line items to scope your claims faster than ever. Fill out the survey below to let us know if there's anything you'd like to learn more about. And be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more expert tips each week.